So the unit is hooked up, as you can see, one wire red to positive, the other one to negative. Simple, easy install. You do want to torque down the lugs that you are putting these behind just because we're going to be cranking this battery and pulling some current through there. We don't want any loose connections, which could give us false readings. Let's jump into the car, jump on the app, and see what we can see now. So I'm running this on a OnePlus 6. As we boot it up here, we'll see, enter, got it. So it's, it's already popping up notifications to the door, which is odd. Uh, but basically, we're at like, uh, what, our battery is okay. I'm not sure if there's above that. We're at 12.45, 12.44, uh, so things like that. So you can see it's, it's graphing it out here at the bottom, which is pretty cool. Uh, so that's our voltage test. We have a charging test. Now we can do a cranking voltage. It looks like it's gonna want us to crank the car over. So let's go through and just do that. And your cranking voltage is okay. Again, it graphed all of that out as well. Charging test. Let's start uh, the engine. Turn off any devices which consume power in idle, for instance, the radio, air conditioning, and all that. I'll shut off the air conditioning and all that. Really nice laid out. Turn on the headlights only. Okay, we'll turn on our headlights. Start testing. So we're gonna bring the car up to about, you know, saying increase to 2,500, and you gotta do that fast. Let's do it. Do a little bit more. Start testing. I'm not sure if we got it, but either way, it looks like uh, charging okay, voltage okay. So, hey, we're good there. And lastly, we can grab things out over time. It looks like uh, that's not a function right now that we're able to access. But as you can see here, now that the system is charging, it looks like it's uh, at a great voltage here. So uh, I sort of like this app. Uh, a lot of things and details that you guys can look at. It's really hard for me to film this on a DSLR in the middle of a car.